Welcome back to the Autumn Finds channel where you can expect everything from beauty, fashion, hauls, and lifestyle videos. For this video, I wanted to do the fragrances I plan on wearing more in 2023 since today is New Year's Eve and we're coming up on New Year 2023. I want to make a goal of wearing more of my new fragrance and also some fragrances that I don't wear as much of. If you're interested in seeing this video, just keep on watching. Don't forget to subscribe for new videos every week and to be a part of the Fines family. I wanted to start off with this perfume. This is the Valentino Donna Born in Roma Yellow Dream. Ude perfume. This is the 3.4 fluid ounce bottle. Look at this beautiful bottle. I love it. So this my husband got for me for Christmas. This is the Donna Born in Roma Yellow Dream Ude perfume. This is the 3.4 fluid ounce bottle. This is how it looks with the cap off. And this smells so delicious. This really grew on me. Because I normally don't go for like the musky smells, but this smells good. It's fruity with some musk in it. So just so you know, it's in the musky floral family. The key notes for the top notes are Italian Primo Fior Lemon Essence, Bergamot Essence, and Litchi Accord. For the middle notes, it's Rose Essence, Clean Accord, and peony accord and for the base notes it's cedarwood essence vanilla essence and white musk accord and this smells so good this is definitely a perfume i'm going to wear more of in 2023 i love this and i keep gravitating towards this ever since i got this for christmas i've been wearing this so i definitely recommend this i have not tried the regular valentino born in roma the pink um i, I don't know if it's called something else i have not tried that but i definitely want to try this because this is this is amazing. This I definitely recommend. So this is the Carolina Herrera Very Good Girl Ude Perfume. I believe this is the 1.7 or 2.7 ounce. I'll put it in the video, whichever one it is. I can't remember what size this is, but this bottle, look at this. This is one of my favorite bottles. Just because of the bottles itself, they attracted me to this perfume. Um, the, this is not the original Good Girl. This I got because it seems like it was more fruity notes that I liked. Um, so for the details, this is in the floral family. The top notes are red currant and lychee. The middle note is rose. And the base is vetiver and vanilla. And if you look, this is how it looks. So you take this. This is the top. And this is how you would spray the perfume so this is the smaller version i believe this is the 1.7 ounce bottle because the bigger version has different type of top but this you just literally take like this and you pull off i thought that was so cute this is a nice red heel with gold stiletto love and this definitely to me it smells like more of like a date night you will wear with your significant other because it has that very nice good girl slash sexy scent. I, I can't explain it. It just smells really good. So this is definitely I'm going to gravitate more towards in 2023 also. This is the Marc Jacobs Decadence. Uso Decadent. Um, this is the Uday Toilette. This, just the bottle itself is so cute. That's why I said in the past Marc Jacobs knows what he's doing. This is like a little purse with a gold chain. I love it. This bottle is everything. So this is definitely more of like a woodsy type smell. I recommend this towards like the fall time. So the top notes in this is Nashi Pear, Black Currant, and Green Ivy. The middle notes are Pink Lily of the Valley, Magnolia, and Jasmine. And the base notes are White Amber, Casimir Woods, and Raspberry Gloss. This is what the bottle looks like when you take off the top. So it's very pretty. I love the look of this bottle. Um, this is the 3.4 fluid ounce bottle. And this is very hard to find because I believe it's discontinued. 
but I've had this for a while um, and I don't wear it as much just because the woodsy type smells in it um, but I really want to wear this more in 2023 so this is the Marc Jacobs Decadence Eau de Toilette this concludes my fragrances I want to wear more of in 2023 if you enjoyed the video, please subscribe for more videos in the future and comment down below with fragrances that you love or fragrances that you want to try in 2023. Don't forget to subscribe to be a part of the Fines family. I hope you have a great rest of your day and Happy New Year. Bye. This is why we call the channel Autumn Fines. So I'm going to show you where to find the things, where to find the clothes, where to find the deals. Just stay with me, okay? Stay with me. Okay, just stay with me. <laughs>